in today's video is just going to be a chit chat get ready with me so yeah we're gonna close this door because the smoke detector is currently going to keep saying low battery so if it's annoying i'm sorry might be the same so Y'all told me to go to Shop Miss A and get some products, so I picked out six things just because at the time I was on a budget and I didn't go to work and to get my check. I haven't even been to work since I've been out of school. Broke, well not no more, I got my check now. But I had $10 in my account and shipping was like $3.97, so I was only able to get six things. <laughs> it's okay, I'm not, you know mad at that i can only get six things you know because sometimes that's all we could afford honey but yeah i got a lot of a lot no six things is not a lot so first before we do our eyebrows and blah blah blah, 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 blah we're gonna be trying this wonder skin this aoa studio wonder skin product right here you know everything i bought was a dollar you know that's all i could afford everything was a dollar except for shipping all right, so this is how it look. It's glittery. Uh, so I never had a primer before, so that's why I really wanted to try it. So it's the Perfecting Blur Primer. Oh no, I got this one just because it was clear. And it smells kind of weird. So this is the primer, and this is how it is on my face right now. Hands are clean. Okay. What the fuck? Can I ever do things right? No, okay. I'm, I'm coming to that conclusion that I just can't do anything right in life, and I'm okay with it. You know, we're going to accept the fact. Ashley can no longer do things the right way. Oh, I'm sorry if I'm looking this way. It's because this is where my mirror at, and plus I'm using my back camera, so excuse me. I never did it like this before. So, the primer is on, and I'm... Glitter is, like, there. I see glitter on my face. Can y'all see some of the glitter? Some people said the glitter don't show, but it's definitely showing... Oh, I didn't read what it said on the back. It says a skin perfecting primer that blurs imperfections and boosts the radiance of foundation. Then it just says how to use. Apply from center of your face outwards and let it sink into your skin before applying foundation. Okay. So, that's what it's for. And honestly, I'm liking how it feels. I never had a primer before, so that's interesting. So, now we're going to do my eyebrows. And I just got the, the AOA Studio. This is all AOA, except for one thing, so I'm not about to keep naming it. But this is the Sculpting Brow Pencil, like this, in the shade Dark Brown. Can you see that? Yeah, low battery, we understand, honey. So you just take the caps off, so. Okay, the caps are falling. Um, just take. Oh, my bad. One end has a spoolie, and then the other end has the product that just looks like that. Beauty Girl Real Stallions. Ow. <laughs> okay, so I used this last night. I didn't technically do my eyebrows. I just wanted to see how, like, if it matched my brow color, and it did. So that's a great step into everything. So, yeah, y'all can see. My face is kind of clearing up from the nair. Yeah, kind of. So, yeah. So, now I'm just going to take this. I mean, we already know how I do my eyebrows. I might just fast forward this. But I'm feeling in this part right here. Because it's the part that, like, the nair ate up. Because I put the nair right there. Duh. Okay. That's pretty much it. That's the only part I try to fix. 
eyebrows really don't need to get filled in so yeah now we didn't buy concealer or nothing like that because I just rather use my own concealer if you know what I mean everything is not going to be shot miss a but like so yeah concealer won't hurt me using my own concealer this is a concealer that I use it comes from the beauty supply store so this is how it looks it's beautiful it makes my skin so nice and radiant and it just melts into my skin so you should yeah we should love the good a good milk <laughs> Alright, so I'm currently uploading a video as we speak, kiddo. <laughs> Sorry. It dropped and I almost had a heart attack, you know. Okay, that wasn't a fart. That was just my nightstand that I'm sitting on. <laughs> okay. So the primer is actually don't know i don't know how it makes it feel but i put it on my face and y'all will be able to tell i don't i don't honestly i just wanted to be like i got primer see i'm trying to get official you feel me with all my makeup yeah even though it's cheap i can still be official if i got every makeup but like not like high end because like you have to go to work to do all that and honestly Work is not in my category at this moment, you know. Money is money, and right now it seems like I don't care if I'm broke or if I'm rich. So, this is the life I choose, and we're gonna be living with it. Not we, because y'all don't gotta be broke because I'm broke. Mm -hmm, yeah, I'm gonna blend this in. I definitely feel like that primer makes my surface weird. Like, okay. Well, maybe it doesn't because I never put primer right here. Okay, actually. Stop it. We're going to tell how it blends when I blend up here. Um, That is a lot of glitter, honestly. Oh. When I blend up here, it's definitely super smooth. I can definitely say that. It's smoother than the bottom of my eyebrow hairs, you know. It's not rough. Oh, yeah. That shit feels, it feels good. That primer made that feel great. So, sorry. I know some of y'all asked me not to time, not some of y'all. One of y'all asked me not to time lapse my videos, but y'all got to understand. I don't film on, I mean, I don't edit on a computer. So my videos can't be as long as I want them to be yet just because I do everything on my phone like I film on my phone I do all that so until I find like an editor or something to let me have my videos longer than 15 minutes because you know iMovie don't let you do that or like if I just find an app that lets me upload it right from my phone because YouTube capture do not work right it takes forever for it to upload so that's why I just like using um I I use I upload my videos straight from iMovie by the way so that's why I can't have my videos over 15 minutes until I find something different or really good good at editing on my phone I mean on the computer then I definitely will use my computer and have longer videos I did buy a foundation it's a matte finish foundation and it's just too light for my skin basically so i cannot use this but i did try it i'll insert a clip now of me using this foundation comparing it to this one we're just going to use concealer that i never used before like as a concealer i i don't ooh ooh ooh, ooh. we might be playing we might just do some things I forgot I'm doing my eyes. Shit. Whoa. Okay, let's see if we can just work this concealer out. See how it blends and stuff with the primer. You know, the primer just makes everything great. So let's see. Okay. 
ओके I go crazy on my blending because I'm a paranoid person with my makeup. I always think it looks bad and ugly. So, um, yeah. So, this is how it looks. Now, we can tell the difference on the face. Uh, yeah, we can. It's not bad. Hmm. It's not bad, is it? I don't think so. It doesn't look bad to me, personally. Okay, so my camera cut off. So basically what I did was I did my whole eyeshadow look and put on lashes. But what I didn't do is finish up the whole eyeshadow look. So that's what you'll see. And I only primed one side of my eyelid. The other eyelid that y'all about to see did not get any primer on. I totally forgot. But yeah, hopefully y'all enjoying this so far. I'm sorry if it's a little bit all over the place. I did film on two different devices, my iPod and my phone. So bear with me here. I try. I'm doing the best that I can. Uh -huh. Love y'all. Continue watching. Okay, so I put on the lash that I picked out. Clearly, it was a mistake. If you go on Shop Miss A, these don't look like that bad on the website and it had like a model or somebody that like got sent their product and tried this eyelash on and it didn't look that bad because i like really big dramatic lashes but not like this and honestly i don't think this amelia whatever she, this is her name would be that bad if they didn't put like two layers of it so it looks like two eyelashes combined into one that's why it's it's really it's like a it's bad and it looks like i just have a bush on my eye like for a night look at that i'm gonna try to show y'all what i'm talking about can y'all see if i turn it to the side here how it's like two eyelashes like amelia would be so cute if it but now I'm just going in with that brown. And the brown and the orange is from the Biatch Cosmetic Palette. Now, that palette, the colors on this the uh, Biatch Cosmetic Palette, let me say BH, because y'all might get, like, what the hell you keep saying that for? I just like Biatch Cosmetics, okay? I'm sorry. But the that palette, the BH Cosmetic Palette, is very buildable. Like, I can build it up. So it's not that bad. Like, I can build up the colors if I really put time and effort and, you know, do everything right. I can definitely build up this color. But on this, I don't think I can. So, yeah. Like, if I just kept on going with this orange and attempt to build it up, it would definitely work. Because you can just pack it on and it would be more pigmented than you know what it is well what i'm like able to get it you know i'm just settling for the less right now if you know what i mean like I, i'm not about to do that because like this eyeshadow look is trash because i'm not good at makeup and i'm definitely not good at manipulating like products you know some people can make a dollar eyeshadow palette look good and then there's me so I'm going to take a spray bottle and I'm going to spray it a little bit. Yeah, a lot, not a little. I'm going to spray it and see if it's, I can build it up from there. Like, I don't know if you're supposed to do that or if it's okay, but, you know, I take wrists in line, so we're going to do that. Okay, no, you're not supposed to do that. I'm going to try to dry the brush off a little bit and see now what I can do with it. And now I'm just going to pack it on my eye from what in it. So this is interesting. From what in it, I definitely see a bigger impact than on this eye. Like I definitely see like the product build up and I can definitely tell like this is colored. You can definitely tell it's yellow now.
but this is Amelia. She's trash. Like, don't get her. I feel like she could have been better. Okay, we're gonna go in with a blue i feel like a blue would be a nice pop of color for my eyes if you can see you can't wow oh you can they're right there those are three blues and i think i'm gonna go with the glitter shiny one a mixture of the glitter shiny one maybe just a glitter shiny one i don't know i'm gonna go under my eye wait would you do this after you do your makeup or what I got really watery eyes, by the way. So, that's why I'm trying to be quite careful. So, that is the blue on the eye. I don't think that looks bad, y'all. Okay, so now we're going to put the concealer on this area. Y'all don't know it's concealer on this eye so already, so that's why we're going in over here. That's enough, right? Mm -hmm. So let's give a shout out to the first person that commented on my video. Is um, ooh, I don't know how to say her name, but I'm gonna just say your last name, Renee. She said first, girl. Thank you for being first. Y'all be fighting for that first spot, honestly. Y'all be out going at it. For that first little for y'all to be first to watch my videos <laughs> i'd be like whoa it be going down when i tell y'all y'all be lit y'all be funny because somebody didn't get to be first on my video and they was telling other people to fuck you i don't care <laughs> and she was mad i mean i will be too because she is usually first on my videos so she was pretty upset that she wasn't first and i could understand her pain Cause if I like being first, I want to continue to be first. You feel me? That's just my take. So I'm blending out this concealer, you know, onto the skin. Like I said, I always think it's not, you can never not do enough blending. Blending is infinite. You can do that forever. In my opinion. So. Um. Sorry. Um, I'm trying not to use this as foundation because that's not what it's for. But I'm just concealing the parts of my face that I think deserves to get concealed. You get what I'm saying? And okay, that's enough for right now. I think that's good. I don't know how to conceal, so I'm trying to do whatever works. Well, whatever I think works. Because I'm telling y'all, it's been so much negativity. And it's overwhelming, honestly. Because it's my first time getting plenty hate. I never usually deal with that. I don't know how to deal with hate. Like, I usually... I don't experience it a lot at all. I mean, yeah, I do at school. But, like, it, it's different. I don't know if it's different. I don't experience it that much at school. You know, it might, it might be once out the month from a group of bitches. But, like, it won't be 24-7. But it's, like, 24-7 now. And I guess that's the consequences of, like, my channel is growing. So, I gotta at least either accept it or be a bitch about it. And I'm not gonna keep crying about it. It's just... Whoa. Okay. It's just overwhelming. Like I said, I don't I don't deal with hate on a daily basis. So I'm gonna get teary eye because I'm soft as beach. These lashes are so bad, but.
My concealer doesn't look that bad, I hope. <laughs> I'm, I'm hoping it doesn't. I don't think it looks that bad. It looks like foundation, honestly. That's what I'm thinking. Like, should you just blend all this out? Anyway. Oh, let's put on some mascara. If I have any, I don't usually wear mascara, but I'm going to just take this weird mascara that I got for like 99 cents. looking slayed ain't it coming from the scalp just a little bit giving y'all a little bit of that scalp action i'm trying to definitely get into laying my frontals down better so everything i do is practice y'all i'm practicing every day so none of my things i have mastered so that's why i'm practicing more than anything so yeah okay i don't know how i want my hair to be so let me go look at myself in the mirror and just admire this gorgeous girl because like ain't we all gorgeous including me you know don't leave me out we can all be gorgeous together okay so i'm about to go see if i'm gonna part this hair if i'm gonna put it up or what whatever i decide to do y'all will see what i'm doing so yeah so yeah throw a cake face already oh <laughs> y'all okay so now we about to figure out something with my hair and you know the funny thing is it looks like i have on foundation right every time i go to apply makeup it just looks like my whole face has foundation on it and this is only concealer so i'm triggered honestly i don't know what not to do because like i only put concealer right here right here and right here and then when i go and my camera is just like bitch you got foundation everywhere and i don't but now we about to do something with this hair i'm gonna see if i'm going to put a sign part or something oh that looks just nasty okay so yeah let's get to the hair i'm wondering should i put it back camera front camera like what do you think I don't know. We're gonna figure it out because we always okay. Do. So I'm gonna use the front camera until I go back to doing my makeup because I'm almost done. I just gotta put some concealer on my forehead and call it a day. My whole face looks like I have on concealer, I mean, foundation, and I'm triggered. Honestly, I really am. I don't know what to do with my life. Okay, foundation makeup is not gonna be for me so i think i look pretty ugly with a uh, side part but i definitely want to see how i will look if i had a shy part
snack. You know, we serving looks looking like snacks and shit. Okay, so I'm using the same Amuse palette. I'm using that blue right there. And I'm just going to lightly put that, you know, in the crease. I mean, the waterline. So, yeah, I'm going to put this in the waterline in my eye. Not the waterline, the lower lash line. Now this blue is powerful. This blue is more pigmented than any color in this palette. These blues are the most pigmented. Most pigmented. And then it's the greens and then it goes to like the yellow colors. That blue just make everything pop. I feel like it just brings open it, it just opens up a beautiful goddess i'm just that look good looking <laughs> all right don't get too up in your panties so i'm just putting a little bit concealer right here because i told y'all that was the last place well if you didn't know that was the last place i had to conceal so i did my forehead while well, i'm doing my forehead my eye and my chin and that's it i don't know where else people put concealer I might drag the forehead concealer a little bit down here because there's not anything on my nose, but yeah. I don't know how to work this. Now I'm going to take this Fit Me Concealer right here from Maybelline and I'm going to take that and put it over my face just a little bit in those areas. I definitely like the concealer look. I don't know. I think my concealer just blends way much better than my foundation. Like, in my opinion, okay, so where it is. That's it. Okay. Okay. Too much watching Queen and Clarence. Okay, sorry. I get to talk like them. Because that should be funny. Okay. Oh, we miss some lips, honey. You know we can't forget them lips because it's all about these small baby lips <laughs> that gets no love and attention or affection because no one likes me. Because I don't like them. <laughs> yeah all right so then the last thing that i got is this wonder ao studio wonder baked eyeshadow And I think that's all I'm going to do. Y'all know I'm not a big fan of highlighter just because I don't really know how to apply it correctly. So I don't like putting on tons of it. Now if I was like slaying the highlighter 24-7, I would have no problem with putting on a lot of it. But yeah, I haven't mastered how to wear highlighter like that yet. So I'll put on... Do y'all see my cheeks? That's why I don't apply highlighter because I don't know how to do it. Very minimal all the time so I just took a chapstick because this lip gloss is really sticky so if you ever find yourself in a sticky situation with lip gloss just take a chapstick or like a car mix or some Vaseline put that on your lips first and then apply the sticky lip gloss and it's no longer sticky anymore well it won't feel sticky it's still sticky but it's, it won't feel sticky while it's on your lips y'all I think I did great so this is the end result of this Shop Miss A video. Everything was not Shop Miss A, but I only couldn't use one thing out of everything I bought this foundation because clearly 
it doesn't fit i made the eyeshadow work i tried something different um i definitely you know if y'all watch the video y'all see the amused eyeshadow works better with a wet brush and yeah so most of everything was shot miss a except for two things the concealer and the other concealer that i use on my eyebrows and my lips was just regular lip gloss but everything else was made from shop miss a what was used from there so i'm loving it i think i look pretty cute let me know how y'all like my back camera better because i'm trying to give y'all the best quality i want to try a makeup look using just my back camera and i think i pretty much did that and uh, yeah so this is how it looks of course i'm not done with the the cute you know nice sledge oh so wait for the outfit <laughs> So this is my finished makeup look as y'all can see. Side part. It's 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 all right, I guess. So I've watched just the end of this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below. What's all this dancing for? Yeah. Be positive, not negative. Cause, cause, um, that's just the right thing to do. Anyway, bye. Have a beautiful day.